we're going to explain how to pair your Microsoft Sculpt ergonomic keyboard. One, first, make sure your keyboard has fresh batteries. Low batteries can interfere with pairing. Open the battery compartment at the back of the keyboard and insert the required AA batteries, ensuring they're placed correctly according to the polarity markings. Two, now we need to put the keyboard into pairing mode. Look closely at the underside of the keyboard. You should find a small button, often labeled connect. Press and hold this button for a few seconds, usually about three to five seconds. You'll know it's working because the connect button might flash or a light on the keyboard may start blinking, indicating that the keyboard is ready to be paired. Three, next we turn to your computer or device. The process varies slightly depending on your operating system, Windows, Mac OS, etc. But the basic steps remain similar. For Windows, go to the Bluetooth settings. You can usually access this by searching for Bluetooth settings in the Windows search bar. Click on Add Bluetooth or Other Device and select Bluetooth. Your computer will now search for available devices. Four, your Microsoft Sculpt ergonomic keyboard should appear in the list of available devices. It will likely be identified by its name, such as Microsoft Sculpt ergonomic keyboard. Click on it to select it. Your computer will then initiate the pairing process. You might see a confirmation code on both your computer screen and the keyboard. If so, ensure they match. Five, if everything goes smoothly, you'll see a success message on your screen, confirming that the keyboard is now paired and connected. You should be able to start typing. If you face issues, try turning the keyboard off and on again and repeating steps two, four. Also, ensure your Bluetooth is enabled on your computer or device. Six, if you're using a receiver instead of Bluetooth, it's much simpler. Just plug the small wireless USB receiver that came with your keyboard into an available USB port on your computer. The keyboard should connect automatically. Windows should detect it automatically without needing any further configuration in most cases. If you're having problems with this wireless receiver, make sure it's properly seated in the USB port and that there isn't any physical obstruction. Seven. If the pairing process fails repeatedly, try removing the keyboard from your paired device's Bluetooth list and then attempting to pair again. Sometimes, there are glitches that this simple step can resolve. Eight. Lastly, remember that the pairing instructions might slightly vary depending on the specific version of your Sculpt ergonomic keyboard and your computer's operating system. If you encounter persistent issues, consult the Microsoft support website for detailed instructions specific to your keyboard